life, more wealth, more health, prosperity, and a peace of mind. Welcome to the Zulu Nation family. If you haven't hit the like, the subscribe, the notification button, and you get all the latest updates and everything we do here, man. So, know thyself. What do you think when I say know thyself? Most of you probably think I'm talking about your flesh, about the food you like. I'm talking about, you know, places you like to go. I'm talking about the clothes you wear. I'm talking about the car you drive. I'm talking about, ooh, I had to crack my back. Um, things that don't matter. Most of us think we are the flesh. You know, the flesh is not you. It's a car, right? And then the mind, the spirit, the soul, whatever you want to call is the driver. And most of us are worried about the car instead of the driver. But if the driver is intoxicated, the car could get damaged. If the driver doesn't take care of the car, the car could be damaged. You know, if the driver is confused, the car can be lost. You know, if the driver is anything, it affects the car. So most of us, think when I'm saying know thyself I'm talking about this Mglini Mglini is not here Mglini is in here control who you are you see my animals right when they're in heat the women's in heat the females in heat they want to just hump the female the males they don't have that aspect of saying that's not what I want to do right now because they're animal but you got to be at a higher higher frequency your higher self because you gotta control it. And most of us don't know how to be nice to people because we look at this and material. Ouch. We don't know how to fall in love because we don't look at the person inside who can, they could be Ouch. somebody who, who's who's not looked at, you know, material-wise or flesh-wise as a 10 or what society says is attractive. And they, they worry about you, they look at, they call you, they texting you, they're saying, what are you eating, where are you at? They're giving you that kind of, you know, real soul bond. And you are worried about the, the person who looks, you know, like what society wants, but they're, they want to be in another soul bond and they're not even interested in soul bonding with you. And you chase it and they finally say, you know what, yes, and it doesn't work out and you wonder, and this person's been right there because you are worried about the car. You're not worried about the driver. Some of us, uh, you know, because we're f with the flesh, we see people with things that we don't have, things that we would like to, to, to have and because it's flat, it's, it's, it's earthly, it's material and we're hating people, we feel a certain kind of way. Some of us won't even be friends with somebody because we're not looking at the driver, we're looking at the car. This is why some of us are racist. Ah! We're not looking at the driver, we're looking at the car. And you sit and wonder why people are in prison, why people cheat, why people murder, why people do these things because of this right here, right? Like, for example, when before I became who I am and started striving and doing what I want to do, I always sat there, I'm like, man, when I get money, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. Because that's what society told me and that's what the flesh wanted. Because the, the, the beast in me, that's another thing. Are you an in, your intellect or are you the beast? You know, some religions believe the beast is the devil, but actually, no. This is the beast. Once again, I go back to my animal. A beast goes off chemicals. And that's what your, your body goes off. Being attracted to a woman. You know, and some people go rape when the girl's like, no, because they're following the beast. Uh, Cheating. Uh, you know, because they're following the beast. Robbing a store. Uh, you know, because that's what the beast wants. And I'm not sitting here trying to convert nobody or say nothing, but that's the, the truth. Even the 666 is actually what makes the human body. If you really into deep stuff like that. If you don't just read stuff and say, oh, my mom said, or my pastor said, or this person said. Go read what hydrogen, carbon, what the human body is made of. So when they speak of the beast in ancient knowledge, they spoke of your flesh. And that's what we all, you know, in love with the flesh wants to be seen so you're horrible to people because you want to be in the top the flesh wants it what it wants but what makes you different from an animal or bots 
I call people who act like animals when I talk to my son and tell him, don't be a bot. A bot is programmed. It doesn't have its own direction. You know, some cultures really believe that whoever made us is putting you here to be tested, that you're beyond the flesh so you can get into a higher place, be divine, be better. You know, that's why even some people feel like when you don't become better, you get reincarnated and you come back and you have to redo this all over. Like I said, man, I wanted to buy the freshest clothes, get the chain, all this, Walmart, Walmart, you know what I'm saying? Be, you know, everywhere, party, you know, lift. I used to lift so I could try to look good so people can, you know, be attracted to me, but they were not attracted to me. They were attracted to the car. So when you lose the car, you lose the people. Let me, let me hit you with that one time again. I was always trying to hit the gym so people can be attracted to me, but this is not me, this is the car. So when I would lose the car, I mean, if I get fat or something, I'm gonna lose the people. But when you get them to be attracted to the driver, which is the soul, it's something else. You have to be disciplined. You need to learn how to control this. This does not make you. You are not it. You are inside them. That's what makes difference between you and a lot of people. That's what makes difference with people who make it and people who don't because when you don't control the flesh, you fall in easily in the worldly traps. There's traps everywhere. This place is not made for you to be successful. It's made for you to fail. Made for you to fail. Made for you to, to do things, because things are hard. When you do things the right way, things are hard. But when you master it though, man, the jealousy leaves. The hate is less. The stress is less. So let's say you're walking and you see somebody you know with the car. You don't stress, you're like, you know what? That's them, they're blessed, I'm good, you keep walking. But when you have the flesh, you, you feel less of a person. Oh, I don't have a car, so that makes me less, you know what I'm saying? If you know you see somebody with a, a person that the, the world has put that they are attractive or they're they're the perfect being when you have your regular person, you know, you appreciate them because you're not gonna go, man, I don't have that person. So now I'm depressed, so I don't think I'm good enough. It doesn't make you, and that's the key why a lot of people are depressed, angry, they have jealousy, they have all these things. Be your higher self. Concentrate on the driver. Forget the car. The driver makes the car, like I said in the beginning of the video. Get to your higher self. You know what I'm saying? You find yourself in less stress, Whoa. less issues, less problems, Whoa. and you'll be worried less about other people. Whoa. And it's hard, it's Whoa. not something easy to do, you know? That's why some people, they, they don't know how to act. They don't know how to think. And, and the more you practice not to follow it, the better you become at it. But when the more you follow the flesh, the harder it becomes. Just like anything you do. You do not make this. This, like right now, you're not. Me, I'm in here speaking. I'm telling this to speak. But this is not me. This is just a vessel I'm in. This is just a vessel I'm in. This is why even my mom, heavy Christian, when she tells me, you know, oh, you, you, you know, you got tattoos. God said this and that. And I'm like, you know, whoever God is, is not looking at this. They look at me inside. What my actions, what I'm doing, how I control the car. But most people think, you know, it's, it's, it's about wearing certain things, you know, being in certain places, all that. No, man, control your car, control your body. Don't be of the flesh, don't be a bot, be your own. And when you control that, everything will come easy. You know, speak positive, concentrate, love. We can't love other people. That's why some of us are racist because of that. Because we're so this. We're not worried about the person inside. Because, you know, oh, I follow, you know, let's say you're a person who follows what Hitler said. Oh, Hitler said the Jews and this person. If you're, you know, a super activist in the black community, oh, white people this. And if you're white, oh, black people this. But that's flesh people. Those people are not 
woke. And not even woke is dumb. Those people are not in their higher self, I'll say. Don't, I'm not gonna say woke, because I don't find myself woke. You're not on your higher self because you're worried about the car, not the driver. Y'all hear, why is this car doing this? Why is that car doing that? This car, but the car is driven. Somebody drives the car. Weren't you worried about the person who's driving the car? The car cannot move on its own. If I take my soul, this is done. Stop it. Let's love one another. Let's keep going. This message today, I don't know why I was just driving. You know, you see, I'm just dropped off my daughter gymnastics. And I felt like, let me tell you, you're not, you know, the car. You're the driver. Concentrate on the driver. Help the driver. You know, give, give the driver confidence. This kind of stuff, when you master the flesh, you build confidence, you build happiness, you build, because even mastering the flesh also talks about working out. Some of us don't work out because we're like, oh, you know, I'm tired. No, the car's tired. You're gonna drive the car to the gym. You're gonna drive the car to work. You're gonna show the car my, you know, mind over matter. Man, come on, man, it's bigger than that. But like I said, we all just stuck in the material world, material things. Things that will give you nothing. Cause when you die and move on, when you move, I won't say with that, when you transcend from here and go somewhere else, this will mean nothing. This is why you find jobs have uniforms, schools, I'm from South Africa, a lot of schools had uniforms because they never wanted the kids to argue about who has the nicest shoes, who has this, it doesn't, we're all same unit. And that's what we need in this world, planet. You know what I'm saying? So, love yourself, love one another, let's put push positivity, speak life. If you haven't hit the like, the subscribe, the notification, it's Zulu Nation, baby.